action <laughs> welcome back to my channel guys if today is your first time my name is chisom and i help young africans to level up on their income and to help other people and we lift up africa out of poverty and we do that using our skills talents our experience and personalities now if this is the kind of thing you want to watch it's a good time to give this video a thumbs up and to subscribe and put the notification bell on because it's going to come like a bang i have so many more videos that you should go back and watch after now and then let's go straight into the video for the day today i'm teaching you how to create a youtube video how to create a youtube video right so so many people have asked oh how do i do this how do i create a good quality video all i have is my smartphone so let me tell you how i do it yes i'm using my smartphone to record yeah so let me tell you exactly how i create videos are you ready now let's go so all over the world videos are a thing videos are the in content style right whether it is an organization or a person but guy you don't want to keep being the one that is not seen not known not heard just because you are shy about videos or shy about you know postulating your opinions and your vibes because that postulation no matter how weird they think it is there are millions of people that that will agree with you now without going into why you should necessarily do youtube we'll get that sorted out if you haven't watched that video where i did it now go straight here and look at the link and go watch that video afterwards here i'm going to tell you step by step how you can create your own youtube video how to create a video right and this works either way whether it's even you're creating it for social media or youtube but of course youtube is our focus so let's go straight into it number one thing to do is of course you've set up your channel already so research the title you want to create the video about now that means you must have chosen the title let's say your title is how to create youtube videos go to youtube console and search how to create a youtube video you're going to see other people probably who have done those same topics that same topic and look at how they frame their title look at how they did their thumbnails and then i'm not saying you should watch the video necessarily because your steps may not be their steps so don't go copying anybody's content it's not necessary what you've got is an absolute gold <laughs> yes then beyond looking at all of that look at how much views has their videos gotten at least in the last one year right so if the video is like 22k views in the last five years mm -mm. if the video is like uh, 14 views well you already know if your video is less than hundred thousand views in the last one year reconsider that title it means that people are not actively searching for that particular topic it means that people don't want to create youtube videos as much as you think that they want it right so that's just a clue so that's researching your youtube your video title for your niche number two thing that i do is i go ahead and write an outline that will guide me when i'm doing the video so i have my topic i have validated it checking out what other people are doing whether people are searching for it whether uh, whether youtube watchers or youtube audience really are seeking for that solution then when i have that checked and i'm ready and i'm sure it's ready to go next thing i do is to sit down paper in hand and i actually script what i should say under each of the points so like i did this video and i have my points up step by step about how i do this process so that i can also let you know the same so the same way outline are just bullet points that will help you remember each of the points as you are you know as you're going ahead in the video the number three thing i do after putting up my outline and is to flesh it out like a script now i'm not i don't mean that you should write a whole speech you will not be able to if you're reading it we're going to know that you're reading it and it's going to come off boring and make you look like unsure of what you're about so but add a little bit more flesh you know in some of the titles so that you can remember certain things that you don't want to forget you know what i mean that's a third step and that helps me have a script i can say okay i'm ready to go now i'm ready to shoot the next thing after your scripts are ready your titles are ready 
or rather your title depending if you're doing one or two videos your title is ready and your bullet points are ready which are your key outlines and then you have scripted it for that to be able to insert certain things that you want you don't want to forget in each of the points the next thing i do is go dress up dress up in a way that will communicate that topic so you don't want to be talking about um let's say um what well, like is an example now you don't want to, to be talking about a day in my life and you're just sitting down all through like i'm sitting down now and just people about how your day went okay maybe you should call it a storytelling time instead of a day in my life because a day in my life people want to see you in different times in different locations different outfits doing different things right so so you get what i mean right so you dress for that topic so for instance i can't say i want to you know show you how i script i'm um, how to create a video like i'm doing now and then i'm out and about in a noisy place or in the market you know dressed in briefs and you'll be wondering that what's wrong with her she's not looking composed for the topic that she's dealing with you know what i mean so i go dressed up do my makeup you know how i want to appear if i wanted to wear a wig i slap it up do my makeup the right way and all that so this morning as you can see okay it's morning here i'm looking minimalist you know straight to the point like girl next door because this is my process video i'm telling the process of how i do my videos okay and i'm wearing my simple nigerian ankara outfit even though it's made into a shirt like top and i love it right so i'm comfortable and i'm sitting in my studio room doing this video so very important so you decide what you want to wear that's what I'm trying to say the next thing I do is then go to the main work where I see the main work well each of the point is a main work don't mind me I go set up my camera and my lighting now for those of us you know who still use our phone who really love our phone because it's, it comes in handy or we can't afford a DSLR yet or you know any of the above is that time that you, you ask yourself okay so how do i set up because first of all you want your video to come out sharp and one of the tricks about sharpness is lighting videos love light cameras love light photo ca photo cameras video cameras love lighting lighting is what accentuates the picture the pixel and make your image very 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 appealing right now i uh, i wish i can show you the light i'm using here but I just bought LED, I, I, I use LED bulbs um, from 40 watts upwards, double of them, okay, one of them, anyway, things in that range, and I can still amplify my background even more, and I'm not using, right, right now I'm not using um, a lot of natural light, I have natural light, but I'm not using a lot of it, right so you can the, the idea is to make sure that you have lighting that you can be visible people can see you hear you and they are not distracted by anything in your background okay but the major light that you need is natural light if you can sit in front of a window just like you know i go open my window when i want to use this particular position natural light that is sharp you sit in front of it so your camera is back in the light put up your setup whether it's books you want to stack up or stack them up so that your camera can be steady you don't want to hold your your, your camera on your hand and like uh i'm um, shaking no you you can do that for selfies and the rest but you can't do that for youtube videos so you need to have a setup that is steady you need to have natural light a lot of it on your face it will give you a creeps 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 uh, video trust me so i set up my camera and lighting i position it to face myself so you have to position your camera to face you if you want to use the front camera your front camera depending on the kind of camera you're using the, cam the kind of camera that is on your smartphone if your camera light um, front light camera is sharper than the backlight then use that if your backlight is, is better you turn it around and put it up in a way that it can capture you and please when you're doing your videos make sure that you have headroom headroom is this distance from your head to the end of this to the video you can see mine make sure that your head is not this way and cutting off a bit of your head you know what i mean make sure that you have headroom and also make sure that you, your image is somehow on one side 
see I have more space here as you can see from here to here I have more space here than I have from here to here it helps you in a lot of ways if if you even want to illustrate things write things I can write them on this side of the video and it will be very appealing much more appealing to you yeah so those are some you know tricks and tips right there that makes the whole lot of difference the next thing I do is to clean my camera lens very important is your phone right so you're always clutching it you're always holding it so there's always you know, like oily greases and the rest that always attach to your phone at that point you want to record it's a good time to clean it properly clean it with a clean material a clean cloth or handkerchief that is not damp at all clean it properly properly crisps on that small dot where your you know viewfinder not your viewfinder where your camera lens is right clean it properly please and then the next thing i do after that now remember my script is ready i've established my lighting i put my camera in a way that it positions me in a good way and lighting is good i've cleaned my lenses the next thing i do is to put my phone on airplane mode you don't want people to beep you or call you while you're using your phone remember you don't want that so you put your phone on airplane mode right after you're done putting your phone on airplane mode then it's almost show time all you have to do is pull that on and then practice using your script practice talking about that thing one or two practices here and there me i hardly practice these days i just hit because you know guys ladies i mean I can flow right and I'm not so hard on myself anymore like before like oh it has to be like this oh they will not like it the, even when I make mistakes now I include it it's part of humanity right and it comes from actual actually doing this thing all the time that's what I've been talking about in my previous video where I talked about soft skills that's what I mean right so practice because you're starting practice and see how it comes off look at the quality of the video after practicing and then if it's good to go then go ahead and shoot now make sure that while you're shooting you're looking at your lens that's where your audience are they are not on your viewfinder so don't look at the, the yourself on your camera look at your camera lens I'm looking at my camera lens and this is where you are if I look this way, which is on my look, me looking at myself, I'm going to be looking away from you. Please don't make this mistake. It's very, very, very important. I see a lot of people do YouTube, and yeah, so my even they have a lot of a lot of followers, and they still look at their viewfinder or at themselves instead of looking at their audience, which is on their lens. Okay, so those are all the tips, and then um, make sure that when you're shooting, that you are at your best. So if you're trying to say, oh my God. Don't just say, oh my God, mm -mm, we're Africans. Be animated, oh my God. If you watch my videos, you see them. I'm very animated. You know, I'm talking to you and you can feel me. That's what makes you my friend. That's what brings people my way, okay? I started this channel just a few weeks ago and no pressures at all. But I love the way it's growing because I know that my personality is coming through, okay? So that is some of the steps, simple steps on how to use your smartphone to create a video a video is your license to content creation that when it lands on youtube i will tell you what there's to do in another video on how to optimize your videos and how to upload it okay using your smartphone yes using your smartphone i'll tell you how i do all of those things in the next video so don't miss it don't miss it all right until i come your way again go right now bring out your smartphone look at the camera pixel how much is you up to 16 megapixel then you can use it do you have bright lights a window that is very large with that brings a lot of light that you can keep your table and set up then go get them ready if you have a conducive environment or a time of the day that there is less distraction that you can actually shoot your video like i'm doing without anybody interrupting or bumping to you you know or even if they bump into you and you don't mind maybe because you're because of your kind of niche maybe your 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 channel is family friendly where you can hug your children if they come then fine but find what works for you and let's meet in the next video okay bye